Hi, this is Tom and Max. <laughs> making a quick video from the from Gainesville where we arrived last night on the Greyhound and today we are sorting ourselves out for hitting the Appalachian Trail tomorrow. And it's not looking very nice outside. And um, we heard that there's gonna be st well, we read up that there's gonna be storms and nastiness, we thought we'll have a, a zero day before any mileage. Um, <laughs> to avoid storms and not make the first night Foggy. Yeah, but not very nice. But this is a, a video to go through all of our kit lists extremely quickly, um, but we'll give more details in a link to a document with weight and price and location when we bought it. So this is what we have with us for the six months on the Appalachian Trail, at least to start with. Um, we have our backpack, which is Z-Packs. So it's the Arc Blast. 55 um, litre, yeah. made of Cuban fibre, really cool and really lightweight. Really awesome. Um, we then have, uh, we'll go into navigation -y part, we've got a compass, we've got a map which Water does route. sort of the first ten, well, the first tenth of the Appalachian Trail, and we've got our Appalachian guidebook, and a pen, good for making notes. Then electronics wise, this is pretty much it, including a phone which will plonk over here. So we've got a phone which is Technology Central HQ. Uh, we've got a head torch with red light and a whole bunch of other cool features. Headphones, a splitter because there's two of us. <laughs> uh, three sets of USB charging cables. Oh, look at that. Three USB chargers like it was meant to be. Amazing. And we have e reader. Don't know how much use this is going to get, but you know, zero days and all that good stuff. We've got some spare batteries for Mr. Head Torch. We've got MP3 player with mostly audiobooks. A rechargeable battery and then this very cool camera which we're using right now this what is it? the Kit Vision Escape 4BW yay very cool thanks Kit Vision, thanks, Kit Vision. and the uh, mount here mount which we're going to use on the poles um, we've then got a new cool uh, personal locator beacon the spot gen 3 moving away from electronics into everything else we've got a seating pad lightweight keeps your butt off the ground. We've got a piece of string for bare, bare bags. Uh, we've got some emergency duct tape, a little roll, not quite sure what for yet, but I'm sure. Gas, fuel, uh, Esbit titanium 750 milliliter pot, a Seed Summit spork, a Wartex stove, a wallet with basically a credit card and a little bit of money. Um, moving into camping, we've got our Z packs. Duplex tent, Cuban fiber again. Really cool. Really, really good. Eight pegs to go along with it. Move down here. This is kind of medical. Um, but first off, we've got passport, bits of paper, copies of things, bank cards, additional bank cards that won't be used very much from England, bank security code thing, um, some sterilising hand gel which will connect to the outside of the bag for easy access, medical kit including KT tape for blisters, tweezers for mites, nail clippers, plasters, bandages, um, other pills for illness, um, antibacterial stuff, bigger things, body glide, all purpose soap for body and clothes. Sun cream should pretty much only need a little bit for our faces. Baby wipes for evening cleanups. Toothbrush with a little head to keep it nice and clean. For myself, some foot powder to keep my feet a bit dry because I think that might be a problem for myself. Um, and then sleeping, we've got our Thermarest roll mat. Our, I forget, a sleeping bag. Quilt. Quilt. Not very nice. Um, with some straps to hold it down on the roll mat. Then clothing wise moving feet up we have we both pretty much got the same gear uh, Salomon not waterproof XA Pro 3D trail runners so they can dry and get wet at the same time some gaiters to keep the stones and the bugs out hopefully three sets of darn tough medium padding socks merino wool of course icebreaker leggings we're moving up the body here, so on the legs part, pants, merino wool pants, 
convertible crag hoppers for myself. We have a towel, not really for legs, but you know, that's just where it's going to go. Rain gear, we've got a kilt. Um, this is the Outdoor Research lightweight uh, rain breaker. <laughs> lightweight goes with everything. Tops, we have three shirts each. One is long sleeve, made of nylon and polyester, nothing cotton. Then we have our jumper, which is icebreaker merino wool. Then we have our base layer, icebreaker merino wool. Yeah, crew neck. Um, our down jacket. Uh, mountain hardware. Really Goes something. Vehicle. We have heady X section. A buff. Le buff. Icebreaker little cap hat thing. Base layer gloves. Waterproof thicker gloves. Cap. Watch. Sunglasses. And then over here we've also got our trekking poles. Then water system. We have, so I squeeze, we have got the Avenue. Avenue bladder which fits on the end of this and is a bit more rugged than the soy squeeze standard ones. And then smart water bottles because everybody says they're really good. The back flushing thing and finally, trowel. Four. And that's Three. it. So there we go, that is the kit. Um, it's been selected. We've done lots of research. Have a look at the list below if you want to find out some more stuff. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye for now.